Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to reset progress on Duolingo application. So first of all, of course, you would like to go and download Duolingo on your uh, phone, of course, if you don't have it. If you do have it, that's great. If you don't, you'd like to go and download it through Play Store if you're using an Android, App Store if you're using an iPhone, or any other store you could be possibly using. Then you would like to go and down sorry and open the application. Then go and create your account. Of course, if you don't have an account, and if you do have an account, ignore all of that. Log into your account and let's just get straight into this tutorial. So let me just go here and open the link application as you should of course or as you already did if you want to follow the tutorial steps and wait that will actually be our home or our main screen on the this uh, tutorial so of course that could be different depending on which language you're learning what is your progress on the application and etc of course as you can see that could be your main screen or if it's your first time this sorry this will be your home screen and etc okay so if you want to reset or remove your maybe language from profile or as we said if you want to reset your progress so first of all uh, can you reset your duolingo progress yes you can reset the progress of a language or remove it completely from the language setting page so all you need to do just go and click at this three dots right here then all, all you need to do if you click here at goals as you can see uh they will you will see here the it's kind of like a profile but we don't want actually want that so you would like to click at this uh icon or or, prof or profile or something and here as you can see of course you can start claiming rewards if you want to gain gems or xp so as you can see you gain gems and xp if you want if you keep claiming this rewards so from here all you need to do just scroll down a bit and you will find this manage courses so if you click on that you'll find this option called japanese and of course that's what i'm learning just go and click on remove for me i don't want to do that and your uh, you will reset your progress and of course uh, no exit and of course you will do all of that from the settings right here so that will be actually for this tutorial i hope you like it thank you guys for watching and goodbye